one of the things I mentioned in the podcast is the fact that this is uh, just a very, very hard game. A very, very hard game. And uh, this version particularly, um, as it gave you a lot less life than further, further um, future iterations of the game did, like Rayman Advance gave you a lot more life and it made things a bit easier because this game was very, very hard. Uh, so this is my first time playing the original Rayman, the original version of the original Rayman, since uh, since having it as a kid. So I've no idea how well I'm going to get on. Um, I've played Rayman Advanced to absolute death, so uh, hopefully that uh, <laughs> that practice and that experience will um, will help me. Um, there's some vague story going on about Mr. Dark. And then this magic hat. In this now unbalanced world, these are very sad electrons now in uh, in cages. And this is uh, these are these are who you're fighting to free. And there's and there's like six of them hidden in each set of levels. And um, you'll need to sort of go come back to earlier levels after you've got abilities gained in later worlds um, to, to find them all and uh, you need to find every single one of them before you unlock the final, the final world uh, to, to, to finish the game so yeah there will be some backtracking happening at some point but I think my priority for now is to I'm just going to play through all the levels I'm going to pick up any electives that I find along the way and then we'll uh, go back through combing all the levels to find the rest before tackling this guy Mr. Dark Right, here we go. The Dream Forest, first world. Um, and each of the worlds is split into three or four sets, uh, sort of indicated by these medallions. So Pink Plant Woods is the set of levels. There'll be sort of four or five levels in here. And we start in, um, oh yeah. So before we go into each of the levels, it does a nice little 3D effect on the image. Um, which is something that was missing in Rayman Advance because I guess, I don't know, Game Boy Advance couldn't handle stuff like that, that sort of data. Uh, so yes, this is the very, very first level and when you start you have no abilities other than jumping um, and you can climb on things. You can't punch, you can't run, you can't grab, you can't hang, you can't fly, so you've got to be quite careful. It's just beautiful. I love the art style in this. I love this dancing flower here. I love these uh, these mushrooms here. They, um, as you can see, they're sort of bouncing and then they start stacking up on each other. Beautiful, beautiful detail. Joyous, wonderful. There's just a hand there, which is nice. This is something else, a little uh, sound effect anime, uh, sound effect that was missing from the Game Boy Advance version. which is fun, and I missed hearing that in the Game Boy Advance version. Another little 3D effect. Right. Some one-ups. So this is uh, Mr. Magic Hat, and he, I think if you have 10 tings, which are these little blue things, you can see my tings in the top, top right corner, then he lets you do a little bonus stage. There we go. Uh, yeah, ten tings. Little bonus stage, you can get uh, an extra life if you uh, if you get it. So I can get ten tings. I'm going to need all the extra lives I can get for this, I think, because <laughs> um, you only have limited uh, limited continues uh, in this game. So, uh, yeah, I, uh, I do want to be able to actually complete it. So once I get the hang ability, I'll be able to hang on that ledge and jump up there and explore it, which I don't have at the moment. And these little uh, bad guy electoons, you can punch them and kill them. Oh, you just saw a, uh, a little electoon kept right up there. Uh, again, I can't really do anything. 
hill. Something quite fun. That's your little checkpoint save points there. So that was really fun. Uh, on the DS, when uh, when the game was was uh, put on the DS, there's one of the uh, tunes as well. I'll have to come back and get that. Um, because the uh, the DSi had a had a camera in it. Uh, when the photographer took your picture in the game, then uh, the DS took a picture of you in real life, and that was then the, your latest picture uh, would be saved as the thumbnail of your uh, of your save file, which was quite fun. Right, so this is Batilla the fairy, um, who makes a funny little noise when she talks, and uh, she gives you your abilities as you go through the game, and I think the first ability you get is going to be punching, because uh, there we go, you get a punch with your fist. Now as you can see, Rayman has no connecting limbs, so he hasn't got arms, legs or a neck, so you can, ooh, so you can basically throw your fist uh, as far as you charge it up, um, and those little plum things that you, uh, you can balance on uh, are very key to this world. Uh, there we go, that's my first Electoon freed. And I believe that there is something up here as well. Come on up. Excellent. So the golden fist that's down there is a power up to make your punching stronger. Oh, oh shit. You can get the speed fist as well, which is quite fun. I'm sure if you jump up here, there's like it triggers an electing. Maybe it doesn't, like obviously it doesn't. Now, one of the things you're about to see is possibly the funniest thing I've ever seen in a video game, or so I believed when I was a kid. You can punch these fish uh, as they pass if you time it right. Oh, I'm just gonna get that electing in my way. I thought that was hilarious when I was uh, when I was a kid. There's a one up there. I'll get that. Mm -hmm. okay. Right. There's quite a few of these guys here. Oops. He's going to run off into the water. Now, if I can get this plum down here. Okay. I think I should be back. There we go. So apologies for the interruption in the broadcast just then. Ooh. Thirteen. I've got to get thirteen tings. <sighs> Christ, this is hard without the uh, the old hang ability. There we go.
greedy. spotted th three electoons uh, before we got the punch so it um, should be quite easy to go back and find out at some point. Ooh. There's loads of these little animations as well. I loved them as a kid. I thought it was so, uh, so technically impressive. Okay so uh, we've also got our first save point. So I'm going to save. Yeah. I've also put a new lithium battery in my uh, in my Saturn, so um, so these saves will be saved. Right, Anguish Lagoon, the second world, second set of levels in this uh, this world. Okay, so these plums swing, and you can see a pig ring up there. And uh, much much later on in the game, you get a grab ability, um, which allows you to to swing from those. Nice, helpful uh, guide of teens here. Guiding you to secret. Now there's a weird, uh, weird mechanic in this game where if you, if, so you can charge up your fist to um, to be more powerful. Um, but also, if you punch whilst jumping, uh, it like defaults to being full power so if you uh yeah if you do a sort of like a little hop before punching uh, then you can usually kill an enemy with like full power without having to charge it up which is a lot quicker which is probably a good tip for uh speed run speed run people that's another little bonus there Get that. you can always hear like a little um like a little ding -ding sound when uh, something appears so often you can like find a trigger point that are invisible in this game. But again, that's something in the Game Boy Advance game that was different because um, you could see just a tiny little, uh, tiny little sparkle that would indicate uh, indicate that there was something to be triggered. God, this game is so good. It's so good. It plays so well even today. Right, okay, so this is a little mini boss. Um, and this is your first encounter with um, the mosquito who will become your friend. Okay. He's just eyes and a nose, isn't he? You can see boss's health down on the bottom left. Um, and bosses were something that were drastically um, in, uh, made easier in the Game Boy Advance version. Um, because um, if you died after having got about halfway through the boss's health, you would respawn with you had full health, but the boss would only have half health. Um, but once you know how to beat them, they are all fairly straightforward. There we go. He floats up there. You start celebrating. As this bundle of body parts falls down. Then you realise that the mosquito's sad and you make friends with him, which is lovely. Uh, which is just as well because you, you're flying on him in this next level. Oh, it's beautiful music, this. So mournful. If anyone cares, those falling falling spikes were a different colour in the Game Boy Advance version. It made no difference at all. Such a brilliant piece of music, this one. Oops. There was a little 
little sparkle there that indicated something was hidden. So maybe, maybe they were in this game as well. Ooh. A little bit of energy there. There you go, super speed. And you just follow the teams. Follow the teams. To relative safety. Roll yeah. shit. Oh, those spikes on the bottom line there in the uh, GBA version. I apologise, Sam, like a broken record with comparing the, uh, the Game Boy Advance version. Um, might find it interesting, might not. But uh, it's not going to stop me. Oh, I like this one. Ooh, look how 3D. Look how 3D it is. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, so I'm going to get another ability here, and I believe this is going to be the hang ability, which will allow me to grab onto the side of the platforms. It's just an automatic ability, but it allows you to sort of reach um, uh, more, well, more out of reach places. stuff. Lovely stuff. Okay, so you can now go and start um, Bandland, the next world, but there's still actually two more uh, two more sets of levels in Dream Forest, which we're going to do first. Aha, uh -huh, so this is Terezan. Uh, and you've got to hit Terezan's body or clothes down from there and then he'll or she, I don't know, uh, will give you a seed um, and you can grow um, grow flowers uh, <laughs> which at the moment you press A and you build a face which is funny and as soon as you collect it you uh, the water starts to rise and then you've got to keep climbing I'm not much health Music is just so good. So good. Oh. This is one where it really helps to, uh, to do a little hop jump. Um, I think is, um, yeah, you can be a bit quicker against the rising tides. trigger point over the over the, uh, the finish uh, sign so uh, it spawns a, a one-up right oh this is Miss it, hit it too far, and it was bounced back the other way. Okay. Uh, he's got little teeth. Okay. Now there is. Hmm. Ah, okay. 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 Right. I think I'm gonna 
let's do this because there's no Neptune down there. So I'm going to try and get him. Okay. Pure love uh, for rescuing them, which is nice. Little butterflies flying around. Beautiful. Okay. Good. Relatively easy. Trail of tings down, you get a uh, 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 like ting will spawn, we shall see. There it is. Excellent. Okay. This is quite a fun bit now. You ride this down the hill, you gather quite a bit of speed, so it's nice to start off slow because if you jump off early, you can get a thing. Exit there, and I'm sure there's another another secret bit you can get to up there. Right, okay. So mosquito's nest. This is now the last one. Uh, the last set of levels in the dream dream forest, dream woods, dream. I remember what's called down. Um, pretty sure. Mm. Definitely. Oh yeah, that's it. Go up here. There's one up there as well for later. Okay. timing. I remember I always found this world just so hard as a kid. Um, which is what impeded my progression through the game because you, I thought you needed to to get the um, to get one of the abilities. I thought that you needed to. I can't do that. That's, uh, that's the death flies. Um, to get uh, the grab ability, I thought you needed to beat like the third or fourth world. When in fact. Um, you, uh, you get it from doing uh, from, from, from finishing this uh, this set of levels, and I was like, I needed the grab ability to get to the fourth world. So I was like, how can I get it at the end of the fourth world when I needed to get it? So yeah, 
Uh, my my little brain didn't um, didn't quite. Um, oh, oh, that's lovely. What's down here? But yeah, I found this, like I said, I found this set of levels so, so hard. Um, so I never, yeah, took me ages to, to actually, well, one, figure out that I needed to do them, and two, do them. Okay. Oh, oh yeah, I need to go back and get another plum. There it is. There we go, up here. I'm sure I saw an electing here earlier. Hmm. Right, 17 things to get. Tense, that. Right. Um, that's good to get an extra life. Eleven lives. <laughs> it does still make me laugh. Right, now where did I get to? Loads of loads of hidden things in the levels that like requires quite a lot of exploration to uh, to find. Knock it out and jump over it. Weird though. Ooh, that's unexpected. This is taking me. Okay. Oh, I'm pretty sure if I manage to stay on that plum, there's some electines down there. It's just blown up. Okay. Okay. 
Oh, this is quite tricky, this one, because there's... Um, I remember, so... Uh, oof, fucking hell, that was close. So one of, the, one of the concessions that the Game Boy Advance had to make was, uh, because it's a smaller screen, um, oh, you couldn't see as much of the, uh, of the level, so uh, some levels were not a problem at all. Um, but this level, I remember, was particularly tough because you, you could barely see where the um, where these flowers were spawning at all. Um, so it made it very, very hard. I don't like this though. I don't like this even now. Straw. Okay. It's just... Oh, fuck my balls. Oh. <laughs> good. Not good. There we go. There we go. That's a bit better. Oh, it's so tense. Are you gonna... There we go. Okay. Ooh. Nice way to find health power. Okay. Ooh. Funny, funny sound effects. So that's, that does make things a bit better. Photographer checkpoint. Excellent. Oh, Oof. that was close, man. Right, I'm gonna try and get onto that vine because then there's a power up up there. No. Nope. Okay, I can get off this plum. Yes, I can. Good. 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 That is some good plumbing. <sighs> okay. Oh. Hard level. Hard level. Oh. Right. What's next? Have we got the boss or is there one more? Oh, oh yeah, this one. It's just very mournful. You see how sad the mosquito is carrying this. It's like he's being forced to do it and he doesn't want to. Quite, quite tragic. Either that or it's a different mosquito. I, I, I don't know. fall out with your uh, mosquito friend uh, because he's still the fight the boss of this world. Oh shit, it's getting broken. Oh yeah. Boo. These guys, all teeth, no brains. I'm glad you got the, the plum, the plum pun, uh, Alex. Oh, okay. Still, still more. 
about this as well is um, the, um, the teams make different uh, different tones um, which is something the uh, suspiciously easy oh yes yeah, so when you get the grab ability you can grab things like that uh, yeah the teams make different tones which is something that the Game Boy Advance version didn't have uh, they all made the same sound and there's quite a lot of, uh, of moments in this in the game where you collect strings of them and it plays like a little tune or something it's interesting right here we go boss fight it is a different mosquito isn't it it's a different one I don't know if the previous I don't know if there's no it doesn't matter it does not matter it's fairly straightforward this guy Drops these things. He ends up dropping bigger and bigger ones. Um, like this. I like how he stands still. Mario panics. But Mario? <laughs> Rayman. Me, Mario, might panic. Ooh. make friends with this one as well. Oh, I do. I think you do. I think you end up making friends with all the final bosses. It's, it's quite lovely. Very wholesome. Do you want to make friends with them? No? Just blows up? Well, there we go. Ha! Huh, right, yes. So now you get the... Um, Grab so you can swing from these pig rings and you can, um, like I said, grab one ups and, and items and stuff. Uh, and you need this to get through the third world, so, uh, yeah. Whee! Save the game just in case anything blows up. That's weird. Anything blows up, doesn't matter because uh, I'll have lost that. 
Uh, so I've still got, what's that, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 Electoons to find in, uh, in the first world, which we'll go back and do, said at the end.